So not only are we going to be talking about the Wix pricing plans, I'm going to explain them and help you find the perfect plan and the right plan for you. Let's get right on into it. So of course, the great thing about Wix is that you can always start for free. So that's something I recommend you do. And from then on out, if you want to upgrade, it's very important that you know what each specific one comes along with. So if we scroll down right here, as you can see, all plans do come with a custom domain, reliable web hosting, AI creation tools, and 24 seven customer care. Depending on the plan you pick, I believe it's business elite. They have priority care. So that's something that will be a little bit different. I also want to note that their custom domain is going to be free for one year. After that, there will be a payment that comes along with that. It shouldn't be too much overall though. So light is going to be basic. So this is going to be for you if you don't have a big budget and you just want to upgrade and get a little bit more that they have to offer more so in terms of the website features. Okay. So you get two gigs of storage, you get multi-cloud hosting, the light marketing suite and two site collaborators. Now, if I scroll down right here, this is going to be a perfect way to really talk about all of these. So we're in light right now. You can see that you get a lot of the things that they offer here. You can remove the Wix branding, which is nice Two collaborators, site analytics. And as you can see, as you move on up from core to business and business elite, a lot of these perks are going to increase like storage space. You go from two gigs all the way to unlimited for business elite. Now, when you move down here, you're going to see that if you really want to get into marketing and maybe selling products and accepting payments, that's going to be where core is going to be starting. So as I talked about before, if you just want to upgrade a little bit more in terms of creating your website, light's going to be fantastic for you. But if you're looking to start, maybe capture more leads or accept payments, core is definitely where you want to be. With light right here, it starts off at four lead capture forms and moves on up from 10 to 25 to 75. So if you're doing a lot of lead generation, core is going to be a great place to start along with the payment tools. In my opinion, this is probably one of the bigger reasons why you'd want to use Wix premium plans, not only for light, but moving on up to core, you can accept payments, which is going to be fantastic. There's plans and recurring payments. You can sell on marketplaces, you can sell on social channels, and there will be automated sales tax if you use business and business elite. So there's a pretty big jump from business to this. So you're going to know definitely right off the bat, like if you need business elite, just because it's one of their bigger plans. And of course, there's so many more perks that come along with it. Okay. So scrolling down right here, once again, these are going to be a lot of the great perks here when it comes to selling an e-commerce. But as you move on up, you're going to see you get plenty more. So for example, like loyalty tiers, loyalty points, expiration, referral programs, these are going to be in more of the business plans as we scroll down even more. Okay. So those are going to be some of the biggest features there. So it's not too difficult in saying like, which one is going to be best for me. I can just go over again once more for you. So with light, if you just want a little bit of an upgrade in terms of the website, you can definitely do that. If you want to start accepting payments and maybe doing a little bit more lead generation, this is going to be great for you as you can see, accept payments, but this is going to be probably, I would say there's a big reason why it says recommended because not only is it better than core, but you get even more in terms of being able to sell. Like you get 10 site collaborators. You can get these standard e-commerce. You can still accept payments, but when we scroll down, right. Uh, here, 100 transactions per month for automated sales tax. That's a very big bonus. And, you know, aside from that, there are going to be like the loyalty. So if you click over right here, you can keep customers coming back for more with each tiers that offer unique incentives at each level. So do you need to use the business elite? You're going to know right off the bat. Are you already doing a significant amount of volume or sales? This one should be pretty self-explanatory. And usually if you, if you're not using business elite or light, I would say business is going to be your best bet. It's only $10 more per month and you do get some nice perks to justify that extra investment. So overall, those are going to be the Wix pricing plans explained. Like I talked about previously, it's always great to start for free. You can play around with them. You can create your websites. And once you start looking to upgrade, that's going to be overall where you want to go. You're getting the basics with creating your websites. You're getting a little bit more. You're removing the branding. You can engage your audience and start accepting payments. You can really start growing with not only accepting payments, but getting more perks in terms of doing this. And this one, Business Elite, you're really going to be scaling. You're doing a lot of volume, and then it's going to make perfect sense if you know you need to get that one. So that's going to be my overview of the Wix pricing plans. I know I went over the pricing page. You know, it's funny because people often leave comments saying like, wow, I could have looked at that myself. You know, my response is going to be yes. You know, you can, you might be able to look at it and see what the prices are and what it offers. But, 
But in my opinion, not everyone is great at like kind of looking at the pricing plans, the features and seeing, hey, does this fit for me? Do I need this now? Should I get this? Where should I start? And hopefully I answered all those questions so I don't get any, wow, I could have just done that myself type of comments, which are inevitable with pricing plans videos. Nevertheless, I hope this helped you out. If you do have any other comments, feel free to leave a comment down below and I will do my best to get back to you. And if you watch all the way to the end, I will leave a free gift down below in the description that can help with building and growing your digital business, if that's what you're into, of course. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching and enjoy.